How can a plastic circle change your life? Seven years ago, I could have never imagined the wild ride ahead of me. Have you ever picked up a hobby or randomly tried something new and it made you feel like the most authentic version of yourself? I didn't know it at the time, but hula hooping would change my life forever. Much like most people in their early 20s, I was trying to figure it all out. Working jobs I hated, trying to find myself, a late bloomer by every sense, just trying to find my place in the world. One day in a conscious effort to numb the voice inside of my head that constantly asked me what I was doing with my life, I started to doom scroll. I found myself on YouTube watching a day in my life video. Maybe they had life all figured out. As the creator shared her day and her perfect vegan meal, she then picked up a hula hoop and began to dance. I can't quite explain what I felt. I was mesmerized. I'd never seen anything like it. After the video, I did something rather out of the box. I prayed. Dear God, I want to start hula hooping and I need a hoop. Amen. And then I did what most overstimulated, overwhelmed, early 20-somethings do. I forgot. Reality set in and the magic had worn off. I was right back to same old, same old. But I guess God heard me because about a month later, I met a hula hooper and she let me borrow a hula hoop. And the rest is... History. In my seven year hoop journey, I've had the opportunity to do a lot of things. Teach, perform, travel, even be in a music video. And all of those things were so amazing. But if I was to think about the most full circle moment for me, it's when people tell me that they started hooping because they saw one of my videos or one of my performances or after one of my classes. They have that same moment I had seven years ago when I saw a hula hooper for the first time and I knew I just had to try it out. Throughout my seven years, I've faced so many fears and learned so many lessons. I look back at the day I found my flow. I look back at the first time I hooped with fire, the first class I ever taught at a yoga studio and I was so terrified. Overcoming all that imposter syndrome for my first performance all the amazing people I've met along the way, from all the hoop drops and all the blunders to one day becoming a professional hula hooper. I have no idea who I'd be if I hadn't picked up a hula hoop all those years back. 
it truly has been a full circle experience. Thank you so much for watching my journey over all these years. And if there's something out there that you've been wanting to try, a dream, a hobby, I really want to encourage you to try it out. You never know. It just might change your life. What are these? Oh, hula hoops. Hula hoops? <laughs> yeah.